Good evening, our Savior, friends, those who join us every evening. We'll give it a few moments, as always, for people to catch up, find out that we're here. It was nice to see the sun peek out just a little bit this afternoon, warm things up, dry them out a little bit. Everybody is out in the park across from our house right now. And so that's a really wonderful and joyful sound, which we will probably share with you. This is the feast day of the Ascension. It is Thursday, May 21st, 2020. Ascension Day is always after Easter 6 and before Easter 7 on Thursday, always, which is why we don't get to celebrate it unless we have an even song or something like that. But if you want to find out more about Ascension, you should tune in on Sunday for the homily. Our order for Compline begins on page 127 of the Book of Common Prayer. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord. The maker of heaven and earth. Continuing on page 128. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Tonight we're reading Psalm 91 on page 129. Let's read it responsively since it's longer. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High abides under the shadow of the Almighty. He shall say to the Lord, you are my refuge and my stronghold, my God in whom I put my trust. He shall deliver you from the snare of the hunter and from the deadly pestilence. He shall cover you with his pinions, and you shall find refuge under his wings. His faithfulness shall be a shield and buckler. You shall not be afraid of any terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day of the plague that stalks in the darkness, nor of the sickness that lays waste at midday. A thousand shall fall at your side and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you. Your eyes have only to behold, to see the reward of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your refuge, the Most High your habitation. There shall no evil happen to you, neither shall any plague come near your dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over you to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you in their hands, lest you dash your foot against a stone. You shall tread upon the lion and adder. You shall trample the young lion and the serpent under your feet. Because he is bound to me in love, therefore will I deliver him. I will protect him because he knows my name. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I am with him in trouble. I will rescue him and bring him to honor. With long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation. Glory to the Father, and, and to, to the, the Son, Son and, and to the, the Holy, Holy Spirit, Spirit, as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is now, now and, and will, will be forever. forever. Amen. Amen. Lord, you are in the midst of us, and we are called by your name. Do not forsake us, O Lord, our God. Thanks be to God. Continuing on page 132. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Saying together the prayer that our Savior taught us. Our Father, who Lord art in, in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it was in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer. And let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Be our light in the darkness, O Lord, and in your great mercy defend us from all perils and dangers of this night. For the love of your only Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. The collect for Ascension Day there are actually two, more about that on Sunday. Page 226 of the Book of Common Prayer. Give you a minute to get there so you can follow along with me. Almighty God, whose blessed Son, our Savior Jesus Christ, ascended far above all heavens that he might fill all things, Mercifully give us faith to perceive that according to his promise, he abides with his church on earth, even to the end of the ages. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God in glory everlasting. Amen. Amen. Returning to page 134. O oh God, your unfailing providence sustains the world we live in and the life we live. Watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep and grant that we may never forget that our common life depends on each other's toil through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. In the silence that follows, please add your own thanksgivings or intercessions. I'm thinking about people tonight who may have symptoms and aren't able to get in to see someone to check them out or go to a clinic. That you would sustain them, help them make wise decisions and open those doors if they need to be opened. We pray for those who continue to serve on the front line in healing and in research and in care. And we're thankful for those who continue in their work so that many of us can just stay home. I want to lift up the staff of our Savior tonight. They just keep going like energizer bunnies, and I'm so grateful, and I hope you are too. They're doing some really hard and difficult work. Continuing at the bottom of page 134. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard, guard us sleeping, sleeping that, that awake we may watch, watch with Christ, Christ and, and asleep, asleep we may rest in peace. peace. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Lord, you now have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory, Glory to, to the, the Father, Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen. Amen.
Thanks for worshiping with us, whatever time you catch up with us. Especially thanks to those faithful ones who are here almost every night. It means a lot to worship with a group together in this way. So rest well, pleasant dreams. Wake refreshed in the morning and listen in those early morning hours for what God might have you do tomorrow. Good night.